Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial. In this one, we are going to be looking at how to edit your vlogs in Filmora. And by the end of this video, we are going to get something like this. So with that being said, let's get started. Uh, let me just close off this tab and I'll just go on to click new project. To change my project settings, I'm going to be going to file and then project settings. Here I'm going to be choosing my resolution, my aspect ratio, frame rate. So normally this depends on the footage that you're working with. But since I have no footage, I'm going to be working with stock media and I'm just going to click on OK. So here I'm just gonna go to my stock media tab and if you also don't have any media what you can do is go to the partners tab and then go to pixels, pixabay and whatever you'd like and select your stock media from there. Since I already downloaded my stock media I'm just gonna be importing this over here. So the next step is to trim your footage and uh, once you're done trimming what you want to do is select all your footage and right click on it to uh, get the crop to fit option and what this does is it fits all of your uh, footage into this screen so that you don't get something like this which has black bars around it a black screen around it so once you're done with this what you'd want to do is now obviously select audio which you would like to work with and uh, we're gonna be working with the audio given to us by Filmora and how we're gonna do that just go to the AI music tab click on the tool tab and click on start and here you're just gonna select your mood theme and genre and just and just go ahead and click start but since I've already done this I'm just gonna be going to the generator tab where I have my audio over here and you can select whichever part you want to work with from the audio now what we want to do is select our opener so for that I'm gonna be going to the titles tab and luckily for us Filmora has compiled some vlog openers for us. So just go ahead and click on vlog and uh, you're gonna get some vlog openers. I have selected one already over here and I'm gonna be using this one. So if you want to uh, edit your text you just double click on the text given and I'm just gonna be writing beach vlog. Beach vlog and uh, to get some footage behind the opener I'm gonna be dragging this one over here okay now with that done uh, you just have to now with that done you just have to edit your footage and place it according to the beats in the music so just like that you have to determine when the next beat is gonna come and I have detected the next beat and I'm just gonna be placing my next clip over here so just follow the same process for all the other clips alright so we're done with the basics now uh, the real fun begins we're gonna be selecting our transitions now once again Filmora has compiled some vlog transitions for us so we're just gonna be searching vlogs and here we have some vlog transitions or you can just uh, click uh, search vlog and you're gonna get some transitions here I have some downloaded so I'm just gonna be using these so for the opener what you wanna uh, what you wanna use is dissolve since it's a simple one and starting off simple is great so once you use a simple one you can use a more complex one such as this one oh and make sure that your clips are perfectly aligned with one another for example you don't want to see this gap uh, you saw just now so, th so that your transitions don't get messed up Now just uh, uh, another tip to make your vlogs look better is 
to make your video more coherent for example uh, I can match my transition according to the clip that I have for example this shot right here the this tree shot right here is a slide is it's a pan shot so what I'd like to use for this one is a slide transition as it makes much sense so yeah just uh, another tip and make sure to use this in your vlogs so once you're done with the transitions just go ahead uh, to effects now for effects what we can do is uh, go search vlogs again and uh, once you get your effects just drag them into your timeline here I have one already and uh, the good thing about this is that you can also add transitions on your effects so for this I'm just gonna be uh, using the same transition that I have beneath my effect layer which is this one and then I can dissolve it at the end so obviously since I don't have any media I don't have any person speaking in my video as it's all just stock media but obviously you are going to have someone speaking in a video and for that you may want to use some subtitles and for subtitles you can just go to the titles tab and go select any uh, subtitle you want just go to titles tab and search on subtitle, search subtitles or just go here a tab ready made for you and here you can choose any subtitle template you want and this one looks pretty visible to me so you can choose this one or choose anyone you'd like so with that being said the video ends and I hope you've learned something from this. If you like this video please consider liking and subscribing and I'm gonna be seeing you in the next one.